Hungarians have always been interested in the arts. Artwork finds its way into many Hungarian shops, galleries, and homes. Artists have a special talent to record the world that they see on canvas. Irene de Mars was exposed to the strawberry culture as a young person. Working on her parents' strawberry farm, she was able to see the work firsthand and put it on canvas. Irene's drawings of strawberry farming, the churches, and Hungarian harvest dance are classic works. I was born and raised, and I grew up on a strawberry farm with my parents and my grandparents. And uh, that's where I learned to, all the things that we done to make a living, which was strawberries. That was the main crop that we had among others, but strawberries was the main one. When I was got interested in art, which was at a young age, um, I, I started drawing pictures of strawberries and uh, things that pertain to strawberry fields, the straw and the, the strawing of the berries, opening of the berries. But um, we used to clean the woods Every year we had to go through the woods and clean the woods before we raked the straw. Growing strawberries is very hard work. You do a, a day's work, you're going to sleep that night. That's in the strawberries, it was different things you do during the year. It's not just going out and picking strawberries. First, you have to clean the woods, you rake the straw, you haul the straw. You plant the strawberries, you have to straw the berries, you have to open the berries, um, and then you have to weed them. You have to make sure it'll have the grass take it over. And it's just hard work all the year long. These two buildings, along with the museum, are the three oldest buildings in Hungarian settlement. The churches were a force that kept the people together. In addition to worshiping, they provided for social entertainment for the community. There were picnics, weddings, harvest dances, and other dances as well. As I grew up as an artist, um, I'd done small things as a child. And then as I got older, I got really interested in the Hungarian um, culture. And, and I'd done lots of posters for the Culture Association. I do a variety of paintings. Um, I've done serious painting with oils. I've done the old masters I've copied and done several very nice ones. And I've done also many Louisiana swamp scenes and I've done flowers. And I've done it mostly in oils, but I also got into acrylics. It's important that we conserve the Hungarian culture because we want our children to know where we came from and and what it was like when we was growing up here. I'm hoping that my artwork will really preserve the Hungarian culture in the years to come. I've also painted a poster of the museum. The unique thing about this poster is that I have incorporated all of the Hungarian names around a border. If a Hungarian person lived in the settlement, the name is sure to be found in that wreath circling the poster. These posters are on sale.